Ethan? Ethan? Today we are in Isabella in the town plaza. We love Isabella. It's one of the most beautiful plazas in Puerto Rico. It's up here on the north coast. And you can see they are very well decorated for Christmas. Uh, the, the mayor's office, the Alcadia, is super festive. It has this beautiful fountain right in front of the, the church also. And this uh, kind of circus display also. So 
tonight we are at the Catholic Church of Isabella called uh, San Antonio de Padua for a wedding anniversary celebration and it's a beautiful church. I haven't been inside of this one. Super tall, buttress ceilings and gorgeous Christmas decorations. So today we are at the mask festival of Atillo and people are just lining up. It goes from the center of town all throughout this whole area. So we have people all along here who are lined up about to watch the, these cool, what they call carrozas. Um, and people who are dressed in masks and costumes from head to toe. So we'll see if we can get a little bit closer and see some of these uh, cool displays. Esta parte es premium. Alright. Papi, si tú quieres te había llevado el teléfono mío y ponía esa mujer. Ah, ya lo escribiste. Well, maybe not on this day because today is the, the mass festival day, so there's a lot of people here. But usually there's more cows than people. As we're waiting for the parade to start, we're just kind of uh, wandering around a little bit down the, down the way. And this is the official crest of uh, Atillo. Obviously, they have the cows and looks like some sort of uh, tree and ocean. So, kind of a cute little spot. Looks like they used to have a, a fountain and some little benches and things like that. A little mini park over here. the beauty of this little downtown. The Parque de los Ilustres, the illustrious people of Puerto Rico. Uh, they have a lot of the different names. And then look at this really cute building right here with all the flags. I think it's the Alcadilla. It looks very, very old. It's a cute little plaza. I've never been down here before. Hey, Eden! Is that ice cream? This tradition 
people of Atillo, there, a lot of them were the descendants of the Canary Islands. And it, in the Canary Islands, they celebrate this day as part of the uh, Bible story where um, people were, the King Herod was sent out a message to kill all the children who were under, uh, all the male children who were under three years old. So this is part of the Day of the Innocent. is similar in uh, in English to April Fool's Day where they play a lot of pranks and do all sorts of stuff so they'll shoot out like uh, shaving cream or silly uh, string they like we saw somebody pour a can of uh, beer on somebody else's head and usually in other years they do even more crazy stuff with the and interacting with the crowd but uh, it's kind of a fun silly day um, celebrating the innocence of the children that unfortunately were killed but um, so having a little bit of fun uh, on this on this day a little bit from the plaza um, downtown in Atillo and now we're at the beach side here and at one point in time this used to be much more of a white beach and it actually looks like it's coming back because the water had come all the way up here and even destroyed some of those buildings but now it looks like some of the sand is coming back um, to make this a little bit better of a beach but it's a nice beautiful um, stretch of a beach you can see that if this if they open this up again you'll have nice access
What happened? The camels eat it. The camels and the horses? Yeah. What happened out here? Why do we have grass out here? What happened? Because there are camels. And, and the horses. three kings? Yeah. What did they bring you? The Let's see. Show me, show me. <gasps> you got some more presents from the three kings? Yeah.